officially the last hunt for me for the 2011 season. Well, here's my arrow. It's got good sign from tip to tip, so I think this should be a quick, easy track job. She ran right through here and peeled off, and then I saw the rest of them kind of do a loop around, so I'm gonna get going on blood, and hopefully she'll be just, just around the corner. Well, here she is. She only went about 75 yards. Great shot, looked like a heart shot. And the blood trail was just incredible. It's December 29th and I'm at my ranch in Vernon. I've been here for the past two days. I was supposed to leave yesterday because today's my anniversary. Well, yesterday I had an encounter with a huge six point that we've been after all season. He's just a giant. He needs to be taken out of the herd and we haven't seen him in person. And I was hunting with a good buddy yesterday and he came in and we just couldn't make it happen. I got drawn on him twice and he turned. So I packed up yesterday, was headed home, called my wife and she said, why don't you just stay? You know, maybe he'll come back this morning. And so God bless her, I, I stayed and deer were starting to come in. I had a doe off in the distance. She, she didn't, she seemed like something was wrong and she left and seconds later you could just hear the grumble of all these pigs come in probably about 15 of them this looked like the biggest one so I went ahead and uh, waited for her to come in took a great shot like I said she didn't she didn't go far at all so I gotta hit the road quick um, I was supposed to shoot a big buck this morning didn't work out I'm excited about this this pig they've caused all kinds of trouble out here hopefully they'll be gone for a while it's always fun to hunt them, but during deer season it can be a pain like this morning when they scare your deer. 